hello guys welcome back to the channel crypto global 100 and this is the price prediction video of shiba inu coin we're gonna do the price analysis live from the zero and we're gonna discuss why this wicked down to you know we're gonna find the reason of this long wick okay we're gonna find why it wicked down to this level okay so stay with me and watch the full video let's head over to coin market cap First, we're gonna take a look at the current market volume 4.0 it's almost 4 billion is the volume due to the latest bitcoin dump okay and we saw a huge you know 40 to 30 percent drop if we take a look at the drop today it started almost 30 percent 27 percent drop so from the you know she buy new coin so let's start the technical analysis so this is the daily chart first we're gonna draw the levels from the weekly we're gonna find out if we can see any level of uh, you know sport or something like that so here is my first level of sport for the you know this level we're gonna say this is the level of uh, you know sport for shiba inu so i'm gonna draw the level three four nine four nine three and 3605 that's it i'm gonna head over to daily now and we're gonna find out the areas why it wicked down to this level you can clearly see it was you know these three these three candles were breakout candles okay after that we saw a test at this level you can see weekly area was respected uh, you know it was respected here you can see here weekly area was respected here now if we can draw a close narrow rectangle here you know triangle you can see this was a breakout phase okay let me show you it was you know candles were moving up and down consolidating and after that with a huge volume you can see it was a breakout and then we saw a huge movement towards the downside and these breakout candles got retested on its way down and this slow and steady distribution had to happen and it happened here so now where is the level if we can take a look at let's try to find out the you know levels here here this is a swing high candle this is a swing low candle this is the swing high candle okay and uh, yeah so i'm gonna draw the level from you know here okay this swing low okay let's draw this i'm only gonna draw the level in here this in between this candle i'm choosing this candle so let's draw the level to the top let's you know just hold on okay draw the level here and i'm gonna draw the level maybe somewhere here that is the level okay okay so these two levels why this because it was a swing high candle before that candle so i'm gonna take this area and also i'm gonna take this swing high candle on the top of swing high candle so i'm gonna draw the level here just try to draw the levels in here okay 2787 and that would be 2963 that would be our level so now guys just take a look at yourself it's right here it got tested so this is how you now the swing high candles that's why i tell you that swing high and swing low candles are extremely extremely important this is the first level let me check out the other one okay let me just check out this one okay now these two you can say you can see clearly this was a ranging phase so definitely there had to be you know a support here it has to be because the price was you know fluctuating in here so that is why it wicked down to this level of 2963 to in between 2787 and wicked right from here so that is why it's a very important year and thank god uh, you know the orders were filled and we broke the you know resistance it, it could have been a resistance if we saw this candle closing below but uh, you know it is closing above so that's a good sign and we have to stay above 3605 right now and we can see although three rejections from this area and it wicked below so next candle is very important very very important the reason being if we saw the next candle closing uh you know below this area then that would be another test to the level of 2963 or 2787 now what i'm trying to find out is the 
level of support in here okay i'm gonna try the optimal area here this could be an area of support here okay the next level of resistance that's the most important so that would be our first level of uh, resistance for now okay it has to close above so these are the levels resistance area for right now okay this is the supply zone okay this is the support one and that would be the support two so clear cut targets are mentioned in here you can you know place your orders you can do whatever you want to but for the price to stay above or stay bullish it has to cross above 4300 to 4200 you know levels otherwise we might gonna see you know here you can see previously the swing high this is the previous swing high candle we're gonna see a closing today here and next candle might be going down to retest this level of 39 and after that we're gonna see some consolidation and after some consolidation with huge a volume or maybe some good amount of volume we can test this level maybe might be we're gonna might be we're gonna reject for the first time but maybe on the second attempt we can break and once we break through definitely we're gonna you know the rally would be starting to uh, move towards the upside so these are the levels or the short term price analysis of the shiba inu coin and for further targets i'm gonna make a video and if we just draw the levels in here just let's try to find out uh, you know find out the level in here so right now it's not making any trend lines i'm more of a sport and resistance fan so right now this is the current scenario of shiba inu so thanks for watching guys take care and bye